We are just a week away from one of the premier rocket launches of the entire year. And before the Starliner's demo flight, there's another rocket launch you can watch on the Space Coast. News 6's James Rivero joins us with the huge week ahead. I think everyone would, would like to have an early Christmas present next week. And Christmas is scheduled to come early for thousands of space enthusiasts. This afternoon, this Falcon 9 rocket completed a test firing. SpaceX says it's a go for launch Monday night and then Friday morning, United Launch Alliance and Boeing are targeting the first flight of Starliner, their spaceship for astronauts. We're ready to go. Boeing says teams remain on schedule for a sunrise uncrewed test flight to the International Space Station. We're looking very good. Yesterday we completed our flight readiness review with NASA. Starliner is one of the most anticipated missions of the whole year. Ignition, liftoff. NASA's other commercial crew partner, SpaceX, launched its test flight of its astronaut capsule back in March. Space Coast Office of Tourism says the other really big draws this year were the two Falcon Heavy launches. We tracked cell phone data. We tracked about 100,000 incremental visitors. Wow. Executive Director Peter Cranus expects tens of thousands of more people on the coast next week. The week before Christmas, you have two launches, people just enjoying their time with their family for the holidays. It's a, it's a great time to come out to the Space Coast. Provided the timing for tourists and space flight line up just right. Is it really important for the crews to do this before the holiday? You know, we, if something doesn't look good, we're going to wait and we're going to make sure we fly when we're ready. In Cape Canaveral, I'm James Sparvero getting results news 6.